A controversial LGBT display at the Temple Public Library continues to draw attention from both sides of the discussion. Some say they are concerned for children, while others say knowledge is power. Channel 6 News reporter Jillian Angeline joins us now with the latest on the heated debate. Hi, Jillian. Doug, the speech is lasting nearly three hours, dealt with more than just the book display from last June. Many using Bible verses, Center for Disease Control Statistics, and Civil Rights History to make their point. Last year, an activist group concerned Christian citizens says they took offense to the LGBT book and board display. And in response, those in favor of having an open display of information at the public library garnered more than 2,800 supporters in a petition. Meanwhile, more than 950 people signed a petition saying the LGBT Pride Month display went as far as to promote that lifestyle. A certain number of people say they want to protect children's minds and discussions about sexuality are only for the home, they say. Others say they want the library to be a safe place for everyone. And that children who are sexualized too early or too much easily are victimized. And that we as responsible ad adults are supposed to be the guardians at the gate. I don't know what Jesus teaches you. Jesus teaches me to love everyone. No conditions. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what Jesus teaches me. But Jesus teaches me to serve everyone. Now one library board member tells me she was amazed by the standing room only turnout. 